The future is bright at Birmingham City if you look at the number of players the academy is producing of late. A number of academy graduates played a significant part in what turned out to be a mediocre season for Blues and here's a very brief rundown of three local players to feature for Lee Clark's side. You could almost call Nathan Redmond a veteran in this squad now. Next season he'll be the fourth longest serving player at the club and he's still only 19. Redmond's second half of the season was much improved to his first and the winger, having had two full years in this first team squad, will be expected to produce performances that have had him linked with big clubs in the past. Local boy Mitch Hancocks made the left back position his own towards the end of the season. After injury to first choice David Murphy, Hancock seized on his opportunity and should be pleased with his contribution. With him also being such a passionate Blues fan, you'll know he'll always give 100% on and off the pitch. Callum Riley is another local lad who broke into the senior setup under Lee Clark. After making his debut in last season's FA Cup, injury prevented him making a mark on the league sooner. A tidy midfielder, Riley scored his first goal for his boyhood club away at Huddersfield and with Keith Fahey and Morgaro Gomez leaving the club in the summer, next season the Republic of Ireland under 21 international will look to cement his place in the starting 11. One final mention goes to 17 year old Kobe Arthur. Whilst not from the area, he's the latest academy player to feature for Birmingham City and the Ghanaian midfielder has had nothing but praise coming his way from many within the club. Voted Academy Player of the Year, I feel Arthur and many other academy graduates will have a big part to play next season.